mostly positive. That makes, that makes it fun. Hi, my name is Paul Paz. And I'm Paul Paz as well. This is the son and I'm the dad. Uh, Paul's gonna tell us a little, bit about, a little bit about his experience in the hospitality industry. How long have you been in it? Well, about 30 years, 20 as a bartender. Jeez, 30 years, wow. It was pretty quick, it went by pretty fast. Yeah, um, yeah it's been, uh, it's afforded me the opportunity to travel up and down the West Coast. Yeah. And, um, you know, uh, been able to get gainful employment pretty much wherever I go. Right. Um, and, yeah. and your first job was in high school, wasn't it? In uh, the, yeah. What'd you do? Eighth grade, I think. Eighth grade, ninth grade, yeah. yeah. Uh, it was uh, Theo's Pizza and Pasta, just a little family-run pizza joint, nice in the suburbs there in Beaverton. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it was, um, you know, it was just my first foray into it and, you know, 10 pizza places later and a few bars and restaurants later, here I am today. Wow, fantastic. Yeah. Myself, I've been in the business for 42 years. Um, my first job here in Portland was with TGI Fridays. I also worked for uh, Garcia's Mexican Restaurant, Stanford's Restaurant and Bar, and Oswego Grill. More recently, I've been pursuing efforts with my consulting company, Waiters World, but both of us have had, uh, enjoyed great successes as a family. It's kind of ironic, too, because um, his brother, Dominic, also worked for the hospitality business as a bartender for 20-some-odd mm, years. Our, my daughter, Jackie, his sister, is now working at a winery part-time in Napa, California, selling wine. Uh, so the hospitality in general, in the restaurant and hospitality industry at large in America, has really provided a lot of opportunities for families, not just individuals. I hope that you here in Oregon will take some efforts to influence our upcoming workforce and the youth. Uh, I recently had an opportunity to speak with Lincoln High School's Culinary Hospitality Program uh, about what I do in my career path and to show them what other opportunities are available throughout all of our areas here in Oregon. Uh, it's important that me as a board of directors on the Hospitality Foundation for the Oregon Restaurant and Lodging Association, that I take a leadership position in uh, uh, walking my talk. And that's why I take the time to go and visit these schools. I hope you out there, owners, operators, and your lead and key people, that you'll get them into the schools and show them all the different things that we have to offer. You make a lot of friends, a lot of lifetime friends, uh, probably a couple girlfriends in there too. Every <laughs> girlfriend I've ever had came from a job, so you might want to consider that. And there's another perk. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> so, if you will, please take the time again involved with our communities and building our workforce. Thank you very much. <laughs> want to start some families? Huh? Yeah.